Guys, guys, guys. Guys, guys, if you didn't see it yesterday, Fire Sharon interview, his return to the URL, all right? Go check it out on the channel, it's there. But I, I honestly, I was gonna wait till I got home from work, but I just can't hold it in anymore. So if anyone's, cause I, I don't, I'm trying to figure out where all the adults are in the room. I don't, I don't see, I, I'm, I'm starting to believe that the entire battle rap community is full of bunch of degenerate gambling addicts. That's all, that's literally what it is. You guys are a bunch of degenerate gambling addicts because what Midnight Madness is, I've listened to enough to know what this is right now. All right, it's literally an illegal betting ring. That's what it is and they're talking about it in public. They're talking about it in public. Sue Surf, there's no contracts, but we got thousands and thousands of dollars being exchanged. People are going to be placing bets. They're talking about a online betting for the for for the fans via Cash App. Does he not understand that that's all illegal? Anything over six hundred dollars transferred, all right, in a promoted event is illegal. Just look up the law. You look up the law. Every state has their own laws, but that's generally what it is. And California has a very strict gambling law as well. And my prop, my thing is, you want to do that, that's fine. But you have to do that. This can only be done, and it still might not work, on the hush-hush. It has to be done on the hush-hush, where only trusted people know about it. But you guys are leaving a paper trail of evidence, hours and hours and hours of evidence. This is insane. Where are the adults, bro? You are talking about, you cannot just have people bet on things like this publicly, film it, and upload it, and talk about it for hours on how you're doing it. You guys are literally the world's dumbest criminals. What is happening here? And no one's saying anything. I was right about the Cassidy tournament. One of the only people who was right it was a scam. It's over and no one cares. They stole the money and ran. I'm right about this too. There's literally no adults in this community, bro. Because you guys are all a bunch of degenerate gamblers. Gambling is a sickness. 100%. It's a sickness. I have gamblers in my family and they are sick and they have destroyed their lives. Destroyed their lives. The same thing happened in the FIFA community. A big YouTuber started doing gambling on FIFA games, right? And getting the, the fans involved. Guess what happened? He got raided, he got indicted, and he went to jail. You need to learn from the past, learn from history, just learn from the law. You guys are, this is, the fact that no one's bringing this up and even if you're not, you, they're saying, well, the, the money's through sponsors. Sue Surf said there's no contracts. It does. It, you can't have sponsors without contracts. So that's BS right there. You can't have sponsors without contracts. You can't have money moving like this without contracts. You un, do you understand? The, do you guys not understand the law? Or are you confused by the law? Maybe you should hire a lawyer before you keep continuing on indicting yourselves on these spaces 24 seven. Battle rappers, if I was you, I would stay away. And this is not hating because there's a way for this to work. Sue Surf can literally do this whole thing and make it right and legal, all right? You have to have contracts, you have to have legit sponsors, and you have to take the gambling aspect out of it. And keep. And if you're gonna keep the gambling aspect, it has to be, shh, shh, no one can know about it because that's the point. It's not legal, but you're promoting it. I heard Jack Boy Main say the fans are going to do online betting on these battles via Cash App. This is insane. You can't do that. That's illegal. But there's no adults. The only person that I've seen tweet out about this, battle rapper or media wise, and I'm not talking about all media, we know the media, we know which media is, is, is knows what's up. 
B Dot recently just tweeted. He goes, "Y'all are betting. Y'all are gambling on battle rap like this. This is wild. Like, what are you doing?" He's literally the only person that I've seen with any sense. Everyone else is the money. We know Jay Black's loving this because you guys are obsessed with gambling. All right. I feel like that's what's ruined battle rap in the past year because we don't know like again when jay black revealed remember he even revealed there's this big gambling ring and then people are like oh there ain't no more money and people ain't really gambling like that that don't matter there's enough you don't think there's enough we're watching it right now you're gonna put money on the floor you can't put money on the floor like that if you don't have contracts if it's more than six hundred dollars go look it up the law states if it's more than six hundred dollars it has to be declared you're going to be filming this and trying to up, you're gonna upload it onto URL's YouTube channel? What are you trying to get them indicted as well? Are you guys insane? URL, if they're smart, if Beasley is, is a half, half, has half a brain cell, which he, I'm sure he does, he won't touch this with a 50 foot pole, bro. He understands, he's signed with Caffeine ever since they signed with Caffeine. He understands what the legalities are and the, what they go. They're, 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 URL is legal now. They got lawsuits. They're suing RBE. They're being sued by Norbs. They understand the game. That's why y'all are getting checks now. This is crazy. But there's no adults. And that's just the that's just the legality of the situation. Now let's talk about the security of the situation. You're advertising the day it's going to happen in the city it's going to happen. Now it's going to be a super cool table where only exclusive people can show up. They're going to sell hoodies. And if you have a hoodie, you can get in, right? But you're, you're, you're promoting all this money being there. You don't think there's going to be a couple haters that are part of the media or a cousin of this, brother of the battle rapper, cousin of this, people run their mouth, all right? And even Sue Surf, when asked about security, he said, we're our own security. You know, we're, we're going to work on it. We're our, you know, we're our own security. Oh, I know. How, how's that working out? How's that going to... You're your own security. I'm not trying to hate on this, but, but guys... I'm actually trying to save these dudes, bro. Do you guys want to see these guys get all indicted? Or uh, other scenario, get robbed? How about when the battle, how about, okay, with, you're not going to have security? Okay, or you're going to have security. How about when the judges judge the battle wrong? And someone put up five Gs, for what reason, I don't know. All right, and to go to this judging, they lose. He's gonna want. He, he's gonna try to snatch his money back. And then what? You don't think there's gonna be issues here when you're involving this money, all this money, on the line? You don't. You think it's just gonna run off smooth? What world are you living in? Have you not watched mafia movies ever? Do you not understand how what goes on in the back rooms at the dice tables? And the difference between that. It's like you're doing what the mafia did with the back rooms, gambling and this and that, but you're publicly on Spaces talking about it 24-7. Imagine if the mafia was talking about it 24-7 on Spaces, where they're going to be. Oh, we're not going to tell you the exact location, but we're, well, you'll know what day and what city, right? They didn't even have iPhone trackers back then either. They did everything they could to keep that hush-hush. And that's the only way you could do this. You guys are screaming on the top of your lungs. But there's no adults in the room. Because anyone who goes against them is a hater. Anyone who brings up these points is a hater and doesn't want them to succeed. That's not the case here. I want them to succeed. I don't want them to go to jail. I don't want them to get robbed. I don't want anyone to get shot and killed. When you have all this money exchanging and, and battle rap and on these battles and then you're going to put all that money on the basis of some random judges even to search it oh, i'm just gonna be in the room and i'm gonna be like oh you can be a judge you can be a, oh you don't have affiliation with him you're a judge you're a judge and then we got our judges boom 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 and then we're gonna throw the money on the floor we're gonna he literally said he's gonna pass a hat around we're gonna pass a hat around and people are just gonna throw money in there but there's no adults in the room to tell them hey guys this is not legal you can't say in one breath there's no contracts, there's no this, there's no that, you're not and and oh we got sponsors but no contracts. If if you have a sponsor with no contract, you don't have a sponsor. And they don't and Sue Surf literally said that he has no sponsors. It's just people putting up money, which is illegal gambling. Where are the grown ups, man? I don't want these guys to to 
This isn't hate. This isn't me hating. This is me literally looking out for them. I'm trying to look out for them, but they won't listen to me. They, you know, they blocked me from their Twitter spaces. I never commented. I never requested to talk. And I was just listen. I would pop in once in a while and listen to see what's going on. They blocked me. I can't listen no more. Well, I listen on my burner account. And everything gets uploaded to YouTube. But, guys, they've lost the plot, man. They, they might they might be coming at this from a good place, but they're going about it in the dumbest criminal, the dumb, dumb criminal of the year award way. And I am fascinated by all the people who are co-signing this who should know better. This isn't about hating on the league. It's about the law and legalities. You can't fight the law on this. This is dangerous what they're doing. I'm sorry, it just is. And if I have to be the voice of reason and I can take all, I'll take all the hate on my shoulders. I don't care what's new. It seems like I'm always in this position because it seems like there's people in this community that are just dumb. They get taken advantage of. They fall for anything. They're willing to jump to anything. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. You guys can't argue with me about the legality of this. It's 100% illegal. All right. And then let's let's pretend it is legal. It's 100% unsafe when, you can't, when you're going to have all these battlers with all this money on the line. Now they're saying if you're a battle rapper who doesn't have seven YouTube drops... You have to have seven YouTube drops. If you don't have seven YouTube drops, in order to battle on their league, you have to come with your own 5,000 to bet. And you know, those type of battle rappers, they they might not have, they probably don't have that much money. But they're thinking, oh, this is going to be a good look. So they're going to take that 5,000. They're going to, you know, get their life savings. Put up that 5,000. They might, they're going to, they might, they'll lose. And then they're going to be angry. And what do you think is going to happen? Especially if they think they, if they, they were robbed by the judges. What do you think is going to happen? They're just going to walk away? You don't think there's problem written all over this? It sounds fun. I understand. It sounds exciting. But when something sounds too f exciting and fun, you really got to look at the details. They don't know the details. They're winging this. They're doing it in public. And everything they're saying is illegal. It's illegal. But I'm the hater because I don't want them to go to jail. Maybe y'all the haters for encouraging this. Encour encouraging this criminal behavior because that's what it is. I might not think it, it should. Honestly, I don't think it should be criminal. It just is. I think we should be allowed to gamble and do stuff like that. It, But it is. Maybe there's a reason why it is because, again, if it was legal, you would see a lot more violence. That's a fact. So maybe they have, maybe the, but I'm sure the governed the, the law is looking at it more as far as just collecting money and taxes. They're not looking at it as safety, but that might be a, like a, a good reason of why it's kept illegal. I don't agree with. It. I think we should be able to be be free to do make our own choices. But don't battle rap. You gotta go down just like the FIFA community went down. You don't go look it up. The FIFA community went through this exact same thing. You had some YouTubers who thought they can do this. They were having people bet on games, on the, the actual video games. Put money up. Then they would have YouTubers battle YouTubers and put money up. And they all went to jail. They all went to jail. Love you guys.